Lot number 215 is a 1994 Ingersoll Rand P185. This is an air compressor that has been in the city since new. It has very low hours. It has a lot of rust around the enclosure on the underneath where the fuel tank is and mostly a lot of rust corrosion. So I wanna show you what I see up close so you can see what I mean. It has a military hitch. The frame looks strong. The rims and tires look good. It's got a John Deere engine. I put two jump boxes on it. It turns over, but it doesn't start. I sprayed it. I tried to spray it to get it going, but I was unfortunate. But I'm gonna try it again, and I'm gonna demonstrate that it turns over. All right, as you can see, it has a lot of rust around the enclosure. The, the, the panel is good, the gauges look good. It's got 143 hours, 143.7 hours. Very low hours. It's a shame they didn't use it enough, but uh, it appears like it's been sitting here for a long time. And uh, it's got a nice John Deere four cylinder diesel. Uh, it looks to be very dry, good, nice and clean. The oil is good. I took a still photo of it, you can see it. All the connectors look good. I wouldn't doubt it's just a maintenance service on it. It should get this thing running with those hours. But as you can see, the radiator looks good. Just the enclosure around the radiator is rusted. There's some rust there. The plastic container looks good. It's not broken. That's the fuel. Oh, let me check and see if it has any fuel because I was hitting it and I didn't even check it. Oh, good. So the fuel has nothing to do with the frame. I thought it had rust on the bottom, but no, the rust, the rust on the bottom is just a plate. So the fuel tank is good. It's right here plastic fuel tank all right so that's a good thing because sometimes when you have a steel tank they rust out and that's it you got a big investment there but not this one this one has a plastic tank on the side all right it's got the lights it had a tag it has a registration so the title will need to be transferred over let me show you the rust on the roof and it's got a cable here that's that's going with it and the motor's nice and dry Look at that, four cylinder diesel, John Deere. All right, I'm gonna hit it now with you live. Hopefully it won't blow up and hopefully it may start. You never know. I got two jump boxes on it. They're both kind of dead already because I've been starting all kinds of things here. But let's see. That's the door that slammed. <laughs> that scared me. All right, hold on. Nope. Well, it turns over. And maybe I didn't put enough fluid in there or whatever. I'm not a mechanic. Uh, like I said, I do the best I can. And... Uh, it does need some love. It's been sitting here for a while, so you got a diesel mechanic that could work on it and get it going. But it was operational. It's just been sitting for a long time, only 143 hours of use. Good luck.